and deep go ahead and give a tithe and to the, to the Lord. Lord. The Lord is so good. His mercy endures forever. We give you praise, Jesus. We give you praise, Lord. We thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Thank you, Lord. Mr. and Mrs. Mwindu, Mwidu Yokana from Iganga Miracle Center Cathedral, online members have come to give their thanksgiving seed of 410,000, thanking God for the fruit of the womb after seven years of barrenness. Could you come over here, please? Mr. and Mrs. Mwidu. Mwami no Muchala Mwidu. We have some guests here today. William Kakurora Rukuba from Washington, D.C. Praise the Lord. How are you? I'm okay, Pastor. Amen. We are here to thank the Lord. We came here last year in January towards the last overnight. We came to us our sick. I had some issues which were disturbing me. Had they ever been taken to psychiatric Mulago? That was in 2021. November. November. So again last year, again the same enemy attacked me. I got a similar problem. When I came here, I got healed from this place. So the second time I again came here without informing my husband. It was a Saturday, then the next day was Father's Day. I wanted the fruit of the home. And I knelt there in front of the altar. And then I said, Lord, you are the one who answered me. You are the one who answered me. You are the one who answered me. And I'd wrapped myself on this. This was my prayer show. I wrapped myself there. I prayed. I went back and sat there. After the second service, I anointed myself. I went back. Service. On 23rd November, I came here to give my tithe in the same place there. The enemy has been attacking me for long. It's a long story. I cannot explain much. When I went back. Things became hard for me again. But because of the prayers in this place, God did it for me a miracle. I was supposed to give birth on 21st March. But the enemy attacked me. On 12th, I was supposed to go and meet the doctor. On 12th, I was supposed to go and meet the doctor. On 12th, I was supposed to go and meet the doctor. On 12th, I was supposed to go and meet the doctor. I was operated to this baby before the time of giving birth. So this 13th, I will not be having the baby today. So I really thank God of Miracle Center. And I thank God for you. After seven years. After seven years. Praise the Lord. Yes. After seven years. 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 No. The enemy attacks me on 65. I lost the daughter when I was back to give birth. So what's the name of the baby? It's called Mwangu's Isaac, Isaiah. Mwangu's, are you, you are so happy, yeah? Give him a mic. You are so happy. Seven years you've been waiting. Yeah? I'm so happy, Pastor, for this ministry and what this ministry has done to my family. family. Pastor, but the, the condition we were in, we could not even afford the music system. Very early in the morning, God provided. Somebody came from nowhere and brought the music system at the place 
the reception. Everybody started wondering why are we hiding everything from them? We told them we have looked everywhere and we have no money to hire a music system. So somebody who has brought that music system, we don't know him as an pastor. This was the origin of everything. Now, after the the, the party, this man even tied his music system to a very powerful music system and he went. After one week, they started asking us the relationship we had with the owner of the music system. They went ahead and even started calling the man of the music system to come and demand money from us. We told you that we are going to make some believers real mad. May God do for you a miracle. And that believer will go real mad. They will need deliverance. We told them we have been praying here with you people, requesting God to provide for us. The man brought a music system from nowhere. We even don't know him. Even after the party, he went away. Now you have looked for him, you are forcing him to ask money from us. Let him ask God. Because for us, we don't know him. And surely the man also didn't know us. The hatred started from there. Started from there. The, the, we hired people of the same church. Who were videographers. These are people who even refused after clearing all their money. They refused to give us our videos, our, 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 our albums. The, the video coverage. They refused. It was, I think, a syndicate. So they started proclaiming that there is nothing good wish. They started hating us. We used to go for night prayers. But these are people who would attack us openly. They began asking us that you are married. You even have the jobs. Both of you are working. What are you looking for in the church? Go and sleep. We started hating church. We started hating church. Now I said what I was facing outside the church. It is again inside the church. So it is even better you stay outside. Why are you coming to church to pray? You are already rich. Leave us alone. <laughs> May God make you rich. <laughs> These are people, they even came and visited our place. They reached our home. Our home, for real, it is the best on the whole village. Six bedroom self-contained house with a wall fence. But I want to tell you that even our senior pastor he said, this is enough for you. What do you want again? <laughs> Life became so hard. <laughs> My God. Woo! Jesus. I stand here and I say, much more is coming your way. <laughs> Jesus. We started now praying our spiritual. Fire. Fire. These are people who started now putting gifts competition in the front that we compete with the other pastors in the church. They say, okay, pastor so and so and so and so. 
who is winning, who is losing. We stood in front and told them, please, the drama you are practicing in church, Jesus, just all the people who were selling things in church. That the spark of fire that we were now proving that we know the Bible more than the pastor. They started saying the Jesus just people who were sitting outside. We said no, it is very clear. He just those who were sitting in the church. They said no, you look, you go and read in the footages. He said if now this is the issue, then it is better to go and we begin praying online. However much the church is far. But if it gives you peace, it's better to be online and watch it. These are people who started now connecting with my mom. They started asking my mom where we get the money. How come we are the ones with the most beautiful house? But we would tell them for us we pray to God who gives all. Both of us we are working. They are going to ask. They are going to ask them. <laughs> they will ask the villagers. Hallelujah. <laughs> Ah, we would tell them both of us we are working we are not drunkards we don't go to discos our money is to feed us and to fulfill our dreams why are you against our wedding and introduction why are you against our building a good house these are our dreams but the whole village hated us. Hey, but my mother started following this my wife. Told her you will never produce another child if as long as you are in this house. Every time she would come home, she abuses this woman. I would feel so small. I say, God, if I had not wedded this wife of mine, I think I would have separated with the heart to have peace. Sometimes I reached an extent of saying, maybe God sometimes doesn't hear. Because whatever we were going through, God was so quiet. was not responding as if he was dead. And yet he's still living. All that period of seven years, seven years, the gift came from Miracle Center. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Somebody clap your hands with Jesus. The gift came from Jesus. The gift came from the anointing of the Holy Spirit. And yours is also coming. So don't you despair wherever you are. Don't lose heart wherever you are. Here's the testimony. Seven years of waiting. Seven, seven years of your family turning against you. I have had testimony. I've never had anything like this. To, to me, this is another level. Where the whole church starts following you. And say, where do you get the money? Why do you have a good house. Let me prophesy. The whole village is about to ask you, where did you get the house? Where did you get the car? How comes you are successful? May it happen to each one of us. Somebody shout hallelujah. Glory, glory. Jesus died and rose again. My, 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 my. Jesus. Then when I told people we have given birth to a bouncing baby boy, on the first of March, I was about to die in an accident. We were three in the vehicle. The vehicle rolled several times, but we came out without any scratch. Jesus.
Jesus paid it all. Oh, to him I owe. Isaac. Isaac. Oh, to him I owe. <laughs> he has left a crimson stain. He was says why does exactly that is duplicate. Oh no, carbon copy at that away. <laughs> lady those who told you never have another child if you, the kid looks like you they would have said maybe he's not the man's child but if you look at the kid and you look at the father my god real duplicate isn't Carbon it? Copy. Jesus paid it all after seven years, this is the God of this place. Somebody shout hallelujah. It doesn't matter where you are. It doesn't matter where you are. They were just online. And see what the Lord has done. See what the Lord has done. And God will give you daughters. And God will give you more sons. And He will make you rich. Because your God is a good God. He breaks yokes. In Jesus' name. I dedicate you in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. You'll be a mighty man of God. A man of valor. A man of strength. A man of power. Somebody shout hallelujah seven times. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. See what the Lord has done. They even attempted to steal him from the hospital. When I gave birth, he lacked oxygen. So where I was operated from was a private hospital. The machine went off at around 11. So when he told me, I told him I'm going to this baby. I was not feeling well that time. So they anointed and took to ICU. He was attempted to be stolen from me after three days. But I thank God. He appeared to me from the bed where I was sleeping and I was ashamed. I give glory and honor to God. Jesus. Lift up your hands. What we waited for has come to pass. See what the Lord has done. See what the Lord has done. the Lord has done what we waited for seven years seven years yeah, come with Sam. so those of you wherever you are please don't you. miss Friday don't you miss Friday when you come and the church is full Sit outside wherever you can. It's Friday. The Lord will do wonders. He will do wonders in Jesus' name. Has come to pass. Gee, what the Lord has done. Mr. Ivan Gumisiriza, if you could come here, please. And Aluka Grace, Aluka Grace from Bukedea. Bukedea. She has come all the way from Bukedea with 200,000 shillings yes, towards Karamoja. Th those who are watching, please. Listen. What is there is a place what you for? where we need to put some fertilizers in Karamoja. Karamoja. 
the, land, the soil, they did a test. And um, it's near, near the, the mountain. It's most stony, but we need to plant food. We planted food the other time. And the birds came and ate it. But it, it needs some phosphate. Uh, each kilo of phosphate is about... No, no, each ton. Tanya phosphate. Each ton Britani. is about two hundred dollars. Each ton, Britani. which is seven hundred something. And uh, they need about a hundred. Like a hundred tons. Yeah. Each ton takes about twenty acres. Well, we want to try this organic. Organic. It's organic. It's not fertilizers. It's organic. It's not artificial uh, fertilizers. It is artificial. So it's organic. Um, that's what we need. Like a hundred people who can yeah. give two hundred dollars. A hundred people. God will speak to you. Actually, when I when I got the message, I was talking to one of our elders, Mr. Paul, and uh, and he said I'll I'll send I'll send three thousand dollars for that particular purpose. That area needs needs some boosting in the soil so that it can produce. That's why you find out some some of our crops. Uh, if you can give me some clusters, different clusters. Uh, a picture of the cluster uh, of, of what we grew last week, last season. One was big, others are small. Tells you that the nutrient in the soil is not that good. So I believe there's a hundred people there who can give a hundred uh, or two hundred people who can give a hundred dollars. You see, that is very fertile. It is on the slopes of the of the hill, of the mountain. But if you see furthermore, you see smaller one. But yet each one of them is supposed to produce that. So you could see others are small, others are big. The land loses loses um, loses nutrients. Others are high, others are short. So if we boost it. In this season, the land will be able to produce more per acre. So I'm believing God that God has 200 people who can give $100 each. in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Every each, you see those clusters? Others, Put it back, please. The others are short. And this one is very tall. Each, Each one, one of them is supposed to be like that. Each one of them. But because of lack of nutrients in the soil. And, uh, and that, that happens. So we are getting in our chisel plow. Our chisel plow, yes. From the farm to Karamuja. They are taking it this week so that we can be able to bring in more, more oxygen in the soil so that it can be able to main, retain water for quite a long time. So it is, uh, you, you learn more about agriculture than you, you begin to study. Uh, like so uh, there are 200 people out there. And even out here, who, can, who can do that to help Karamoja. Have we given our tithe and offerings? Yes. Okay, good. In Jesus' name. So if you're there, please just, um, and God is going to use you. Let me have some envelopes. Let me give people. Uh, I believe that 200 people who can give a hundred dollars each. Let me pray for you, Father, in the name of Jesus. You always raise giants. You do miracles, Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. So if you're there, you come and get one envelope. And uh, you can bring it on Friday. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name.
Okay, she has brought hers. This is it. Yeah, bring your children. Later, man. Hey, I'm another pastor. Mujie. Pastors' kids come up hither. So let me give the envelopes first. See what the Lord has done. <laughs> See what the Lord has done. What we waited for has come to pass. See what the Lord has done. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. See what the Lord has done. See what the Lord has done. What we wait has come. This week, we can win. this week, we can you are having it. Oh, it's coming <laughs> in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 See. of you watching us by television the power of God is already here God is already touching people healing people but it came in the midst of when I was talking about the fertilizers and you know people don't understand the reason why God wants to make you rich not just in money but in everything in everything so that whatever he asks you to do you will be able to do it anytime any moment if it is that it's about to 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 distribute bibles that you 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 have the the printing press it wants you to go and, and feed the hungry you can be able to do so 
if you want if you want you to build houses for people. You know, people don't understand but God is going to enable many of you to build houses for even your family members for your family your mother your father your relatives the Lord has to he, he died for it you must have it I said he died for it you must have it so the Holy Spirit is going to do great and mighty things. So no matter what the devil does, the Lord is going to help you. Yesterday I was talking about Jerusalem, the city of David. And the Bible said David took it through the sewer. The city was locked. And David and his bodyguard were going to you. So they decided to go through the sewer in order to swim. Could you imagine you are climbing through the sewer and someone is using the toilet and everything is coming down on you. But that did not stop David. He went all the way with his guards and they took over Jerusalem. It was a city on 77 acres. Now Jerusalem is a city on a miles and miles. God is about to give you something. But you must determine in your mind, you must determine in your heart that this is my day, this is my time. If I don't possess this ground, the future will be terrible. Those who come after me will struggle like your children, like your relatives. You must be wealthy. You must be successful. You must be holy. You must be righteous. You must build that house. You must build that church. You must establish that kingdom. Because if you don't, those who are coming will pay a steep price. They will pay a higher price. Jerusalem was needed. Because that's where Jesus died. That's where the temple was built. That's the city of the great king. The worship was done. That's where Jesus is returned. Are you hearing what I'm saying? So child of God, you need an address where God is going to do wonders for generations to come. Oh, hallelujah. You need an address where God will come. You need an address where the presence of God will find you. Where your children will visit. Your grandchildren. When you are no longer here. What David did it is 3,700 years today. 3,700 years what David did to take over Jerusalem from the hand of the enemy. Child of God, you have no choice. I say you have no choice. You are the chosen generation. Your entire family depends on what Jesus is going to do. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Your entire family, your entire future is depending on what God is going to do with you. It's depending on the Holy Spirit. It's depending on the power of God. God. is depending on the spirit of God is depending on the knowledge of God Ramosete kere boshata Riprosete kere boshata Holy Spirit come upon this young man come upon this young man more than ever before spirit of a living God touch him There are times we procrastinate. There are times we say no, not today. But child of God, Jesus had to die. He wanted to postpone it. He said, let this cup pass away from me. But Jesus said, no. God said, no, this is the day. Because if we don't die now, when the Romans are in power, the introducers of the cross, 
we will miss the opportunity and we will go into a generation where they are hanging people by a rope so you will not die on the cross the prophecy said cast is everyone who hangs on the tree so if you don't die now times will change child of God that's what I'm saying Kampala is growing Uganda is prospering the nation is moving if you don't get your position if you don't get your power now next year 10 years from now the land will buy more money it will cost more money now I declare you are going to have your words this year you are going to have your words this year you are going to have your words this year you are going to have your words this year oh lift up your hand and say I am receiving it now this nation needs the gospel the gospel must be preached like what we are having in, in, in Berlin Germany this is a time for Africa to rise up and reach out to Europe. Hello? 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 If the missionaries, if the British procrastinate, they will not have had Uganda. Because the French were moving in. The Italian were moving Could in. Could you imagine Mozambique is Portuguese? Mozambique, Portugal, Baba Fuga. It's Portuguese. But Portugal. Rwanda was taken by French. If, if you said, I'm not going to do it, I am not going to move in. Someone else is going to take it. it. The Bible said the violent take it by force. That's why we're going to raise our prayer life violently. I said we're going to pray more than we have ever prayed. Oh, I won't come back. We are going to pray more than we have ever prayed. We're going to seek God more than we have ever sought Him. We're going to cry out to Him more than ever before. We are going to believe Him for big things. This is the day the Lord has made. You shall be glad. Oh, you will be glad and rejoice. Child of God, the enemy can try to play you. Telling you, you'll try next time. But when the moment has come, and the time is ripe, step in. Step in by faith. Declare it by faith. Walk by faith. You will see the wonders of God. Oh, clap your hands and say, I'm ready. Child of God, it is very, very important that we understand the times and we understand that Jesus had to die at that time because the Romans were the only one who was crucifying people. Now they are killing people by lethal injections. Now they are killing people by lethal Jesus would not have died. Jesus would not have died. So this is the time. This is the time to sow seeds that will bring great results for our tomorrow. I mean great seeds. I said great seeds that will cause a great harvest that the world has never seen before. Oh Jesus. Yes. Oh the glory. Oh the glory. I give you praise. Jesus. I give you praise. I give you praise. I give you praise. Just quit You are born of living stones. Where you enthroned. And as you rose from death in power, come rise with I worship. Come rise upon our praise, and may that that so you raise.
Of the Lord says, Oh, your presence, we love you, Jesus. We love you, Jesus. We your temple. Give you rest. If you have a seat for Karamoja, just come and on the altar. And as it even those of you watching by television, wherever you are, plant your seat today. That the Lord will bless you. That the Lord will bless you. In Jesus' mighty name. Wherever you are, just plant your seat by faith. In your Jesus, we are your temple. Give you reverence. So arise from your race and be blessed. is going to be the greatest week of your life. This is going to be the greatest week of your life. As your prayer is May every need of your life be met today. With your hand, lift your hands and say to the Lord what you want. May the Lord answer your prayers today. May the Lord answer Answer your prayers today. May the Lord pour His Spirit on you today. May the Lord release His grace upon you today. May the Lord open doors for you today. May the Lord heal your body today. May the Lord pour His Spirit on you today. He's mighty, He's mighty. So suffer again. Never suffer again. Never. Never. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. As we glory in your I give you praise, Jesus. I give you praise, Jesus. As your praise is Oh, your Come on, talk to the Lord. Talk to the Lord. What do you want the Lord to do for you? No weapon from the Genesis prosper. Every time that rises is condemned in judgment. That is your inheritance. For the Lord will fight for you. For the Lord will be with you. No poverty. No sickness. No diseases. No suffering. For the Lord will release his power, his grace, and his life. For he is a mighty God. He's a healing God. He's a healing God. He's a healing God. A healing God. A healing God. In Jesus' mighty name. In your embrace. No powers of darkness. As your now feels this oh the glory 
young man. Are these things yours? Yes, I can Yes, yeah, Pastor. Where have you come from? Over the Chinoni Masaka. Masaka. Yeah, Pastor. What's your name? Amanya Gogwani. Yes, I was a Kennedy. Waswa. Why did you start with these things? What time did you come to Why, Pastor? When did you start these things? Because the are old and short cases old. Did you inherit them? Yes, I was inherited Pastor. That's what his daddy used to do. He was a warlock and that's how they used to get their livelihood. When the daddy died, he inherited the witchcraft. He was moving people from light to darkness. Because he was involved in high level witchcraft to survive and to, for, as a life. How old are you? He's 23 years of age. What caused you to to bring these things and Chichi echa kutuse ko kusala ukureta ebintu bino mu church byo chi Pastor nzokufuna amani age kitangala Yes come to get the the, the power yeah. of light Ngode mu manya age kizikiza ko yokubona abona He's tired of darkness and suffering Ndoga ne ndogolo la family yange mwefune echo kulia ne family ya mzei wange mwetufuna kasenta katubeza So you, you send witchcraft to people and then they come to be treated by you and then you Goro gaba ntu atene vajja oba jake dogo Ye pastor Duwalo zate ne vajja no oba jake dogo Adeno damu no baloga Pastor nkoye vintu vino nkoye Dala sagali He's fed up of this stuff What's your name? Amanya Go. Yenze Waswa Kennedy. Pick up that thing. Lord, I wish to you. Shikwe. Him. Yeah. This one. Chino. Smash it on that thing. On this one where the fire has been. Even the one of fire. From today. Every powers of darkness. Every powers of witchcraft. Every demon. Every satanic forces. Every spirit of the devil. Satan and all strongholds. Lose this man. Lose him. Lose him. Lose him. Lose him. Get away from him! Fire! Lose him! You devils in the name of Jesus! Get out of this young man! You demon of the dead! You traditional spirit! You devil! Momo Temoli Nyaria Yes! No sin now! Gain the great diamond! Go, you devil! Gain the great Mizimu! Go, you demon! Gain the your Kebua! Your bank! Cut the your Muro Dora! Don't pass him anymore! Tevi Kerevie! Lose his feet! Where Mizimu is the tumbler! You devil! Mubanga the Mumpeo! In the air! Mbocho Muli Romuli Nyaria Yes! Destroy with fire in Jesus' name! Pick him up! Pick him up! Pick him up! Pick him up! of the Holy Spirit in Jesus my name you snakes 
demon. You devils. Lose his feet in Jesus' name. Stop following him in Jesus' name. When he came lift your hand. Gamba yes. Olwalero Yes, yes, what double and bang, what double and bang, or full edge on the chicha, full edge on the Molina yes, Amina, Kuvida yes, Christo Mongalezama, somebody come your hands to Jesus. Many dreams will come to you. You dream birds. You dream your dead dad. You dream your grandpa. You dream people coming from the grave. When you dream them, you wake up. Don't fear. They are all under your feet. They are all under your feet. Today, may God give you power over the Holy Ghost to overcome the devil, to overcome demons, to overcome the power of the devil. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus. Now, they are going to help you. They are going to get you some clothes. They're going to help you. They're going to find out what you do. What you can do. This bewitching of people. And lying and lying is over. Is over. So they're going to help you. Yes. 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 They're over Chinoni, Saul never deba kumani, the new Kale Mwenabe Chinoni, Namwe Murokoke. You people in Chinoni get saved. Lubare wa Mugumba de Mwesiga Furuse. Your Lubare has been the Kuvira Yesu Christo Mongare Zama. Clap for Jesus. My Lord, my Lord. Take him to Put your hands on your head. Gamba, we Rubare, we Rubare. Toda Yokunta and Bulidako, Toda Yokunta and Bulidako. Bolijoba do ulira kantu mwaka kwetu langa kantoroze. Ye pasta. No gwa wansi. Ye pasta. Kakuva komulinya lya. This is leaves you right now in Jesus name. Kenda mulinya lya Yesu vek in Jesus name. Thank you Jesus. Wewe ni Yesu. Thank you Lord. Wewe ni mukama. Somebody clap your hands to Jesus with some mighty God. As we grow, glory, those of you watching by television, these days are days of greatness. These days are days of power. These are days of the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. Tomorrow night we prepare ourselves through the learning of the palm oil. And the olive oil. the olive oil. Then Friday night, it's going to be awesome. So if you're here, you came. You don't know Jesus as your Savior. And you want to accept him as your Lord and Savior. You can come. Let's pray for you. In Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Otherwise, may the Lord open doors and gates for you and release resources. Friday is our day of thanksgiving. We are coming to thank God for what he did for us at Calvary. So bring your best seeds. We give you the glory. God richly bless. See you tomorrow.